Regine talks about having kids and what she expects on the first and second date. Hola, everyone. So sorry for the technical difficulties. Um, your girl had to have some surf text and some. First of all, I do not drink Dasani, but that's the only thing that I can find right now. So some water and um, a little fanning down. Um, but back to the questions, do I want kids? Of course I want kids at some point in time, no time soon. <laughs> like, honestly, I can do without for a couple of years. Like, no. no. I have enough kids around me, like my sister, and I'm like, oh, yeah. my little TT babies. I got a lot of TT babies, I got everything, all. In my hands, I, why add more? <laughs> oh, why add more? What you really doing tonight? Nothing. I mean, not just kidding. I'm really not doing anything tonight. Um, I'm supposed to be going somewhere with, well, Neat Neat is um, supposed to be coming. And we're supposed to be doing something, but who knows, you know? I am single. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm answering a question. <laughs> um, okay, yeah, y'all, really, like, I ain't even gonna lie. That little allergy shit really turned me down, but we back, we back up, we back up. Because that shit pissed me off. Um, what else? Like, what's another question? I'm not... Well, I am on a sh well, I have, okay, so I'm on a show right now that's called Social Society, and, um, and, um, it's on Watch All Black, All Black, and, uh, basically it comes on every Monday, you know, it, a new episode drops every Monday, and you can watch it on All Black, you can watch it on, I watch it on Amazon Prime, but black because that's what it is but you can watch it on amazon prom too and you can watch it a couple of other places i've been doing that um mardi gras why well, i'm not at mardi gras because i have to work today and because um i really like to be on a float when i go to mardi gras so i can like oh it'd be so fun and that ain't happening this year because you know it's just not so that's why i'm not there um, are you going back to school? I said, listen, I just said that earlier. We don't know that. We don't know about if I'm going back to school yet. Like, come on now. <laughs> Love your hair. Who's the best stylist to do a one-on-one -on -one with in Atlanta? I mean, my hairstyle is good. Her name is star underscore struck on Instagram. Um, for wigs, I also have glamorous hair for quick weaves hair by Brie Renee for quick weaves as well. Um, and others natural and styles, quick weaves, super or whatever. Um, who else? Glamorous hair do good ponies too. Um, who else? Well, y'all know the obvious of people too. Like, I mean, I don't have to tell y'all like. I'm telling y'all who my team is, but y'all know like the obvious people that's good, you know. Her gonna get you cute. Y'all know Atlanta is the glam. Why is my heart going all over the place? Atlanta is the glam place to come. And we got a whole bunch of dope little dope stylists, makeup artists, and um Wow, I'm gonna take this off. It's like, okay, like, Atlanta, best place to live, girl. I don't know. 
Oh, they said who for quick weaves it cut out. Oh, I'm having connection issues. Yeah, I'm about to get off here because if I'm having connection issues, that's horrible. It'd be so cute. You got makeup on? I have makeup on today. It's okay. I love it. Oops. Oh, no, I'm not. Okay, next question. <laughs> How you link up with two rare? Well, really, I was out eating in LA and I saw, and we saw each other. And then we was like, hey, hey, let's do a TikTok. Hey, yeah. And we did it like that. What's your fantasy? Fantasy? Get, what's your fantasy? Get a fantasy. Fantasy. Mm, fantasy. Um, I don't know. I don't know how to answer that question. What's my fantasy? I don't know. What type of fantasy? <laughs> What's a cute first date? Okay, let me tell y'all that. So y'all get into the good ones. Okay, the cute first date. Listen out, y'all. Listen out. Let me tell y'all what it is a cute first date. Okay, so like. A cute first date is like, you know, obviously y'all gonna be like talking for a minute though. Like, maybe not first date. Well, if it's first date. I'm extra. I want you to go above and beyond. So let me just tell y'all what's a cute first date for me. Okay. A I will take either way, but my first way is this one. A cute first date will be like, okay, so like he texts me, he'd be like, hey, put on something, I'm gonna take you out, boom. So then he gonna be like, okay, I'm gonna be like, oh, so what I put on, baby, where are we going? And he was, like, he gonna be like, I have it outside for you. I'm like, okay. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna go outside and I'm gonna take my clothes that he has for me. And I'm like, <laughs> this is the first date type shit. Yes. <laughs> yes. Uh huh. Yeah. Not Valentine. No first date. <laughs> okay, so, so like after I get my clothes on, I'm like, oh, I look cute. So where we going? <laughs> so he got the driver to come pick me up. <laughs> Y'all already know the driver is gonna come pick me up, and the driver just gonna be just taking me somewhere, and I'm gonna be like, oh my gosh, where am I going? <laughs> I'm be like, I'm like, where am I going? So um, I ain't gonna know where I'm going, and then I'm gonna pull up to a stadium where like it's gonna be hella lights everywhere, and it's gonna be. Like, I'm just kidding, not that, but I'm gonna pull up to like a romantic like. He could probably like rent out something like maybe a movie theater or he can rent out like a restaurant or a restaurant room or something like that. Just something very private because I don't really like people in my business like that, you know, because obviously if that happens, we're going to get caught and the shame room's going to have it. And yeah, so just make it private, please, baby, because I do not want you to be seen on a first date. I am sorry. I do not know if I like you. But I'm gonna like you after I'm gonna like you because so what you doing up until this? Okay. <clears throat> so then we gonna get there and um basically, you know, he just we just gonna have a good time. Then after that, you think it's gonna be done and he be like, All right, and take me home. Make sure I get in and leave because he don't wanna do the booty with me because he loves me. And he respect me and yeah that is my amazing first date that is so <laughs> so yeah that is my first one my second one is you know a movie and a dinner and um a movie and a dinner and like, but he still got to rent out the movie theater. I feel like, come on, bro. Like, you can rent out the movie theater. It's literally like, not that, like, come on. You can rent it out. They've been doing rent out since, like, you can rent it out. 
So, yeah, I feel like definitely renting out <laughs> the back. So, yeah. Basically. They said a movie that is. Girl, that is not a movie. That's real life. And that can happen to you if you set it down. The next. You're not doing that for me. I'm sorry. You're not my boyfriend. You're not going to be getting the title. I'm going to need you to send me a black box with my outfit in it. Text me saying, let's go out to eat. And when I want, when I pull up, I want to be wild. You don't have to rent out nothing if you don't. If Baby, you know, because I'm all for whatever you could do. So if you want to just make me wild. Damn. I'm a wild bitch nowadays. Shit. Shit. All right, but. Basically, yeah, what's next? I don't like the stuff creak. But, um. What's next? Y'all didn't ask me this my whole life, how I feel about being Lil Wayne daughter. My whole life. Literally. Now, you can literally Google it. It's probably like a million questions on a different platform. On me answering it back. I don't know how I feel. It's amazing. <laughs> Great. You know? So, it's amazing. Girl, just Google that answer because I think I probably switched it up a couple of times, but it's all in the same. Yeah, it's great. What did you get? Girl, why are you trying to know what I got to know about you? Thanks for tuning in to 9MAG TV.